check this out. So the latest version of Mesh Tool, sorry, the latest beta version of Mesh Tool, this isn't out yet, I'm just testing it for the guy, um, has support for hotspotting, which you'll have seen probably in the Half-Life Alex level design tools, Hammer 2. Um, so as an example, I've just made this random brick wall and it's UV'd terribly because I am who I am. And I'm gonna select a quad, I'm gonna select all the quads and just press hotspot UV and there the heck you have it. So we've got nice little grimy corners here. This is a texture that I stole from Half-Life Alex, except it's low def because that doesn't have texture export. So I just seen ca uh, screen captured it. <laughs> um, yeah, so this is pretty amazing. Uh, it's not perfect yet. So I imagine he will wait until it is a bit more uh, perfect before he releases it. But um, check this out, I'm gonna make some random crap. Just the sort of thing you might want to do. If you like a brick wall connoisseur. Get some slanty ones, why not? And I'll just uh, select all my quads again. Hotspot UV. Away you go. So this is obviously like kind of a lifesaver if you do level design and miss the old days when you could do level design and ship the result anyway. So um, how does this work? He's basically cloned the um, subrect editor from Half-Life Alex. So if I have a look at my trim sheet asset, you basically start with your trim sheet and you make a bunch of fucking squares. So I'll just redo this one so you can see how, how it works. Um, you can just add a box or a, if I clear that, you can draw a box actually like this. You can draw another box. God, this is so easy. Um, you can also clone drag the, drag the boxes and I was about to show that and I just got caught up with how amazing this is. Here, I'll, I'll just make a junk box so that I can clone drag it. Look at that. Back to the drawing. All right. And um, there's a setting in here for each box, allow rotation for if you want it to be able to rotate. Um, we don't. And yeah, that's that's the hotspot asset. So then you select that in the content browser and you press it and you get something like this. Um, so something else you can do, I you've probably heard of the ultimate trim thing from Sunset Overdrive. They did a great presentation. I screen captured one of their normal map uh, trim sheets and made this into a hotspot asset. Um, and so now I can uh, select all these do, 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 do. hotspot UV. And if I set this to my sunset overdrive test material, this is not a great example, but if I had uh, a better trim sheet version of this, you can see that I basically beveled every edge without beveling it. Um, I'll show you a better result for that, that I think I have lying around here. Uh... So yeah, that's uh, on some of these faces, that's a pretty decent result already. So yeah, I uh, look forward to this. It's probably coming in like, I'm not gonna say when it's coming because this isn't my product, I'm just testing it. But you should download, sorry, you should buy on itch.io mesh tool or it's also on the Epic Marketplace. So buy this plugin because it's, it's really good already and it's about to get better. I'm super hyped. If you couldn't tell, you should be hyped as well. Later.